Just being Chris, boy. And right. Is it Tuesday? It is Tuesday. What's up, people? How good that's looking today. Tuesday night, Chris. I don't know what day it is. I've got a newborn. What am I? I'm never putting Bermuda down. Safety salad. Yeah, man. No free shoes. Shut up, Falcon. Stripes are crooked. The, the deer is working. Sam, what's happening, man? I haven't even started. My stripes can't be crooked. How do they look? Yeah, they, you can see them pretty good, right? Where'd the chat go? I wish Connor was giving me a new mower ball. <laughs> I don't know where Jeremy is. He's never around anymore. No Jeremy or Jimmy. No, Ryan Norda never come around these parts. Hey, freedom shoot. What's up, Trevor? All right. Hey, where are you going?
I never wear shoes. Drone madness. Lawn care addicts in the house. No, no shoes, Chris. You motor with the tornado? What the crap, man? Why didn't you scream that? Wednesday night, that's right. Uh, I am using a PGR, Ben. I'm using, I'm using T-Nex, Quali Pro T-Nex. It's generic Primo Max. I just applied it on Saturday. Yeah, barefoot mowing's the best, man. You guys should get on barefoot mowing. You know, then you can freaking tell what's going on with your grass. Con yeah, Connor, Connor didn't pick up the crap in my yard. My dog poops in the back. Yeah, Paul, here again, man. I can't live stream the back because because my Wi-Fi sucks. Yeah, that's true. Uh, it's at point six. Hey, hey, now, chill out with the foot fungus. The edging blade? Uh, maybe. Oh, uh, Heritage Heritage G works great for athletes, but. Yeah, Jeremy, Jeremy has to ask permission for me to uh, come on my lawn. Hey, look, he's here. That's, he was asking permission. That's why he was late. Is he new? That shit went out. So, looking around. I don't ever wear shoes when I mow, Jeremy.
giant rock in the yard. Cheater strides. No cheater strides today. Yeah, Jeremy, your lawn looked great in that video. Way better than that other dude who's not here to defend himself. Hey, you know, I learned something really, really funny about about mowing with no shoes there, Trevor. If you don't stick your feet in the reel, you don't cut your toes off. It's crazy. It's crazy how that works. <laughs> Jeremy's lawn is the greener lawn. Well, his channel is the greener lawn. Yeah, well, I made two passes, Jeremy. Um, the difference between uh, the Scott's fungicide and my like, professional grade stuff is active ingredient percentage. That's really the biggest difference. Usually they've got the same type of active ingredients, just different percentage of active ingredients. Why am I using the John Deere? Because it cuts better than the Toro. Yeah, Atticus Finch. It cuts better than the Toro. I would scalp your front yard, Jeremy. Don't let Connor hear you. <laughs> Come get it. Come get the mower, Jeremy. I don't know that I want to give you this John Deere, though. Yeah, I really don't know if I want to give you the Toro or the uh, the John Deere, Jeremy. The uh, the Toro cuts better. I mean, or not? No, yeah, the the John Deere cuts better. I mean, like I legitimately think it cuts better. Will it fit in the back? Yeah, it'll fit in the back, dude.
So, hey, so Ben, do any of my neighbors real much? So, look right out and where is it? Not this house, but this house, right over there. Um, there that dude mows the outside strip of his lawn with a McLean, and then he mows the rest with a zero turn. It's kind of weird. I think it's, it's different. It doesn't look terrible, it's just weird. John, you don't have to look for things that make me suck, right? No, dude. Oh, we're down. Shut up, Jerry. Uh... Yeah, Ben, freaking sub the lawn tools. What the crap? Yeah. Freaking sub the lawn tools. What's up with that?
There needs to be a channel for the left tool because he'd have way more subscribers. He's way cooler. Um, the temps here right now, correct me if I'm wrong, Jeremy, I think the high today was like 65. It's all right. I mean, you're still pretty cool. Just not as cool as left tool. Everybody likes AA run better. It is true. I know it's true. Well, I, I managed to mow the grass in like 15 minutes. So what's up? Yeah, that was an airplane that just drove by. That dude has, like, a giant wing. Are you the younger brother? <laughs> Jeremy, I've already told you to come get it. Why do I have to do everything for you? Mine goes fat. Yeah, so... If you, so the thing with real, real mowers, Andrew, is um, they're all controlled by the, uh, the throttle. So like if you, the higher the throttle, the faster it goes. So I don't run mine wide open. I run it fairly, fairly low down and it, and it cuts the same no matter what, because the reel is spinning and covering the same distance whether you're going super fast or super slow. Let's do this scalping. Come on, man. Let's do it. Uh, yeah, it'll fit in the navigator. Um, how long have you had a real mower? Uh, I've had a real mower for like a year and a half now. Um, uh, California low to mid eighties weather. Would you put down Milo on common Bermuda? Milo loves heat. So yeah, or not Milo and Bermuda loves heat. Yeah. Throw it down, man. Um, Trevor, I am not yeah, it's pretty freaking heavy, Jeremy. You can take my ramps if you want. We can put the transfer. Well, I took. Yeah, we can put the transfer wheels on and put it in the back of your navigator. Um, I'm not getting a triplex for the backyard. My backyard's only like 2,500 square feet. It'd be like two passes. I can't get a triplex. You are you actually coming, or are you just saying that, Jeremy? Am I on the Carbon X bandwagon? I am on the whatever I can get cheapest bandwagon. And Carbon X is probably not on that list. So unless somebody like gives me some, uh, I don't think it's a bad product. It looks like a good product. But the problem with buying fertilizer on the interweb is you have to pay for shipping. E even when it's free shipping, you're paying for shipping, right? So when... I've got to pay a ton of money to ship it because it's heavy. It would be cheaper to uh, just buy something local. Uh, and the, the, real, the real mower will not cut it three inches. So if Jeremy's going to take it, which he, he says he's on his way, he, he even put it in capital letters. So that means he's serious. Um, so we'll see. I guess he's going to mow. Uh, I mean, I think it'll mow up to an inch. So if he's going to do it, I'm cool with it. That'd be, that'd be exciting. He might be late. Um, Striper Man is coming to show me how to make stripes. So Striper Man, guys, excuse me. He's got a freaking Fiskars with a Checkmate Striper on the back. Pretty cool idea. 
Yeah, come on, Striper man, come mow my lawn. That's my that's been my plan is to just get as many people out here to mow my lawn so I don't have to do it. It's a lot more enjoyable when you film someone else mowing your lawn. So what's up? What's been happening, guys? I had fun. I had fun with you mowing my lawn too. And I had so much fun that I went and bought a drone so I could I could film myself from up high because because I like this drone so much. Jeremy Jeremy is late for everything. When is LC Hen coming? I, that's a good question. I keep asking that guy, but I think he may have blocked me. You won't need to come by plane either. Why, are you gonna ride that manual reel mower all the way here, man? That's a long way to push that mower. Aren't you in like New York? Come to Cali. I try to stay away from California, man. I don't wanna get I don't wanna get locked up for like thinking about a gun or something. Um are we how far away is Jeremy from me? Uh it depends on if we're talking greener lawn time or like normal time. Cause like it takes me like twenty to twenty five minutes to get to Jeremy's house. It takes Jeremy like an hour and a half to get from his house to my house. So I think we're, <laughs> you do have a cape. 15 minutes. He said he just left. He's texting and driving. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Connor, he probably would only keep, come see Connor. Just like, just like how Ryan Knorr came to town and he w he was too busy to come see me, even though I'm like, five minutes off the interstate that he drove up to go to Connor's house. He couldn't stop and see lowly old me. He's going to join the show. Who's joining the show? Jeremy? Oh, yeah, they went to see Perry, too. Perry, yeah. Uh, how far am I from Connor? Connor's like an hour, like almost two hours away. Um, the mower that I used is a John Deere 180 Bravo or 180B, however you want to call it. Uh, Ryan, what's up, Ryan? Yeah, you creeping in there? Yeah, blame the driver. I would blame the driver too. Um, yeah, it's a 180B and like brand new, man. I, I don't even know. I think they're like eight to ten thousand dollars brand new, but I bought mine from the Weeks Auction Company. Hey, shut up, Jake. Go back to school or something. It is Tuesday. I forgot that it's Tuesday. Um, but yeah, I bought my I bought mine from the Weeks Auction Company, uh, and I paid like one hundred and ten bucks for it. So I'm not really sure how much they would cost brand new. That <laughs> crazy drive. Yeah, Connor is kind of a crazy driver. Uh, <clears throat> see, Jake, I'm gonna do this all the way until Wednesday night. That's that was my plan. Yeah, Jeremy is the safety, Sally. He got really mad because I passed him going up the canyon because he was going too slow. He's he's so slow. He's gonna. He said he's on his way, but it's gonna take him like an hour to get here. Like it's gonna be dark. My battery's gonna die. It's just. It's just gonna be. You guys aren't even gonna see him. Oh, no, that's not him. Am I in Utah? Yes, I am in Utah. Southern real mower in the house. What's up, man? I used to be down in your neck of the woods. I was. Uh, I was born and raised in Gwinnett County, so right down the road from you. Uh, did you have to get the reel sharpened on the deer when you got it? I did not. I honest, I honestly didn't do anything 
to the John Deere when I got it. Like literally nothing other than like start it. Uh, it was in pretty good condition. The blade was sharp. The bed knife is still the same bed knife that I have on it now a year and a half later. Um, Connor probably would have taken it to like 15 mechanics by now. Um, but, but I didn't. Do I have headlights on your mower? I don't have headlights on my mower, unfortunately. Um, don't kid yourself, pal. Andrew Johnson. Um, yeah, man, my parents, my parents are in Loganville and they're like, dude, it is incredibly hot down here. Uh, come back to Georgia and real mow in the hundred plus heat. No, no, thank you, Russ. I am coming back to Georgia in July, but, um, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I'm not looking forward to hundred degrees if it's going to be that hot, especially with humidity. Uh, CFO lets me, I'm moving to a John Deere from a, from a true cut. Uh, yeah, man. Hey, shoot me an email. Southern real mower. I'd love to come visit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, nah, man. I feel like I feel that way too, Ryan. The other day it was almost 80 and it was, I felt like I was going to die because it's been in like the fifties and sixties. It's been, it's been really cool here. Um, man, yeah, the pool sounds really good, Russ. Uh, I, I'm planning on going to see Mr. Castleberry. I know he doesn't come around here very often, uh, but I think I'm going to go try to mow his lawn when I'm there in Georgia. If I have, if I have the time, hopefully I can go by the Southern real mower too. That'd be cool. It is hot, Jake. Russ, I forget you've got a you've got a real mower, right? I don't remember. Hey, have a good one, Southern real mower. Yeah, I'll look for it. I'd love to pop in. Ugh. Jake, what's up, man? I know I'm not. I'm not Jake the Lawn Kid level. Jake's, Jake will have like 200 people on there. Yeah, trusty True Cut. Hey, I, I haven't used the True Cut. I'd be I'd be interested to see the True Cut, honestly. I know there's there's a couple people that have them that, that like them. Ooh, are you gonna get something from the week's auction? Are you gonna try at least? They usually have got some good stuff, man. Especially if you can wait till like later in the catalog. That's when I got, that's when I got the John Deere. I got it like way back, and in the back of the catalog, and I got it super cheap, for like 110 bucks. You're not out of school yet, Jake. Uh, yeah, not 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 bad for a free mower. Yeah, I hear that, man. Any any free mower is a good mower. Maybe you could let Mrs. Ward, I don't know. I don't let Mrs. Ward do anything. I got nothing to do with that lady. Hey, you know what? Just watch, just watch for it. <laughs> do I have to ask Jeremy for permission? Yeah, I do need to ask Jeremy's permission to go see Ryan. Um, you guys have... Jake, you're in like freaking Indiana. What you guys aren't supposed to have s snow days. You're supposed to just go go to school no matter what. Did <laughs> a quad cut on Sunday. Ugh. No, thank you, Sam. No, we don't. We like we like cool weather. Uh, yeah, I would I would like a two sixty as well but i don't think my yard is not big enough to to warrant a 260. the 260 is pretty cool i had that uh matt guy brought his 260 up here when uh a couple weeks ago and it seemed like freaking monstrous i know it's only a 26 inch and it's only like five inches bigger than the than the greens master 1000 but like i don't know it seemed huge it seemed too big for my lawn 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, John. 80 is too hot. I've gotten I've gotten too used to the this cool weather that we've got going on here in Utah lately. I do know have a guy know a guy that's got a yard big enough for the 260. Are right, you're getting one, right, Pockin? You're getting a 260? Weren't you like driving up to get like a bunch of them? And then trying to sell them to like recoup the cost of your trip? Or did you end up only getting one? The difference between a 260 and a 1600 is a 260 is the John Deere, and the 1600 is uh, the Toro. So that's really the only difference, I think, other than paint colors and whatnot. Practically the same mower. Tom, what's happening, man? You're getting it next Friday. Are you dri you're driving out to like Montana to get it, right? Jeremy said he's on his way. He's picking up two of them. What are you going to do with the second one? Are you going to be like uh, lawn tools and use both of them? You got a brand new lot, Tom? You got to grade it? Oh, there's Jeremy. Just kidding, it's not Jeremy. <laughs> yeah, you, you probably need it. Second one's going to Wisconsin. Who's getting the second one? You're driving 1,200 miles. Wouldn't it be cheaper to just freaking pay somebody to do it? Uh, oh, yeah, you're 550 West, like out here in Weber County, 550 West. Oh, Jeremy's and Roy, he's getting close. It will be a Wednesday mo by the time Jeremy gets here. Oh, you're not far at all. You told me that, though, Tom. So you great, did you spill a new house or something? Yeah, that's closer. They're closer there. How's the little boss? She's in there. Hopefully she's not in there screaming or I'm going to be in trouble for sitting out here talking to people on the internet. But Jeremy's coming. He'll, he may be able to get me out of trouble. He'll go in there and apologize to my wife. Oh, nice. Well, then at least you're already driving there. That makes sense. Yeah, that's nice that they're on the way, at least. It would suck to just drive to Montana for no reason. I want a 2600. Why don't, you, why don't you just bring one down here? We're not that far from Montana. Jeremy could use a 2600. or 260 or whatever you want to call it. Oh man. Now I'm just waiting on Jeremy. I'm just going to hang out here until Jeremy comes. Is, is this what you meant by being grounded? I may have, she may have locked the door by now. Jeremy's on the way to get me out of trouble. I don't know. I don't know, Jeremy. Last time you got me into more trouble. What's the deal with those California real mowers? Uh, I, I've never used the California trimmer or whatever it's called. Uh, I mean, I think they're, I don't know that you missed out by not getting it though. I think they're homeowner grade, which I, I guess isn't terrible, but I don't know. I, I, I'm a big fan of the professional grade stuff, but I've never used one like 
the like the sword men. Oh yeah, I don't don't let her hear that. Brad, you're trying to get me in trouble. My wife is great, and I don't make her make me sandwiches. Um, yeah, I don't I don't know anything about the the California trimmers, there, Tom. But I don't. I don't know. I know. I know Ryan. If he's still here, he loves his swordman. Um, every Connor claims everything, though he thinks everything is his. That's what he always says. Jeremy, where are you at now? Don't text and drive. Maybe he is. He, he, I don't know that he knows that he's um, babysitting. Yeah, I don't blame you, Paul. I wouldn't want to be in California either. No offense, California. I mean, California, you can take it then. 24? Oh, he's close. He's close. Who's got the electric one? Ryan? Yeah, dude, I want that electric one. What I really want or need is a 7 or 8 blade reel. <clears throat> yeah go check out connor's place yeah yeah i i'm sure ryan would let me demo his but that means i gotta go all the way to iowa and that's a long way from here utah is not very close to iowa in case you guys wanted to know a little little geography lesson for the day Stop freaking rubbing that crap in. My Swordman Electra will be here next week. It's not going to be here next week. Freaking jerk. Yeah, listen to Paul. Smash that like button. Um, yeah. Oh, look at that. Now we're at the 13. Way to go, Paul. 14. <laughs> um, yeah, I really want to try that Electra. Um, I, I I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to come down and try that out, man. If you go to Connor's out, do a full Reno, yeah, spill some glyphosate. He wouldn't he wouldn't mind. Um, I am super jealous. I don't know anything about the Swordmans other than that, like, everybody who's used them loves them. I know Connor was all like, it feels like a tin can. But Connor, Connor thinks that everything sucks because it's Connor and he's Connor. That's right, Jeremy. He said he's getting off the freeway. It's only like, it's only like three minutes from the exit to get to my house. Yeah, bring it to my house and we'll freaking rub it in Connor's face. That'd be awesome. He'd love that. Uh, I cannot confirm or deny that, Jake. That's classified information. But there is a possibility. Uh, no, that sounds awful, Tom. No, I've heard a lot of people having issues where they don't have good soil because, uh, because the builders just leveled everything out and took out the good stuff. I feel you. I feel you. Suck Brothers Incorporated. Yeah, John, that's right. I am founder and CEO. Yeah, uh, email about the Milo shortage again. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. I don't, that's why I don't use Milo. I don't use stuff that's going to be... I mean, I use Milo occasionally if I can like find it for a super good deal. But it's not like my main source of fertilizer. I'm a big fan of liquid. 
liquid fertilizer. It's called for a bid. They went 380 for 10 yards. Ooh, well, that's not awful, man. I mean, is that, all, is that all it's gonna take? Yeah, Russ, Russ says humid, humic works well. Just put a crap ton of humic down. How did it work out? Did you get it? I know you said you were good at getting the last parts. Um, did it work out well for you? Like I, I was telling you, man. Uh, oh, Jimmy. Jimmy's like way far south. He's like an hour, uh, over an hour from me, south of me. I'm glad it's working for you, man. The, does it, do your nozzles leak as badly as mine do? Or is it just mine? I mean, it works great. It just leaks. You just gotta like pay attention. Uh, some gypsum, yeah. I, I don't know on that one, man. I don't know about gypsum. Jeremy's two minutes out. So you guys gotta hang out another two minutes at least. Jimmy, <laughs> you're fine, Jake. Jimmy is legitimately like one of those people that is that are you can just he, he's just super nice, super nice, nice guy, way nicer than that Jeremy of the greener lawn cat. Uh, yeah, when there's no back pressure, that's what happens. That's the same thing with me, and I'm not I, I'm not in love with it. I don't know what the solution to that is. Like I said, I was thinking about trying out different nozzles, but I'm not sure. It's not awful. It's not a deal breaker, but it's not the best thing in the world. <laughs> oh, nope, not Jeremy. Wrong car. quiet that jeremy honking his horn yeah yeah man i don't know what i don't know what the solution to fix that is if you figure out the solution let me know maybe maybe jimmy could talk to my wife jimmy's jimmy's way too nice hey look who it is jeremy of the greener lawn everybody in the house. He really did show up. Hey, Coven. Coven, did you wear shoes when you did your night mow? My dog is not thrilled with Jeremy being here. Dog's not digging me, man. <laughs> dog's not digging me. Came for only one thing. To be on the live stream? Oh, okay. All right. So I came for two things. I had to have a little bit of attention, I guess. He did. He needed some attention. <laughs> What's up, man? What's going on? Oh, you know, just hanging out with my 24 friends on the internet. I know. We're, uh, you're getting big time. Right? I know. 24 whole people in here in the house. So is it weird to record? A recording? A recording. Jeremy is recording. You guys recording me. <sighs> What happened? I, I don't know. Where'd the string go? You broke it. <laughs> there it is. Jeremy owes, owes you three bags of Carbon X, pal. Yeah. What the crap, Jeremy? That's only good for some people. That's only good for some people, but Jeremy's got to get Carbon X. Jeremy's trying also. to come up here and get a lawnmower for free, and he didn't even bring me anything. I'm here. I'm here. Isn't that good enough for Look, you? since you came here, my, the people watching went down. Well, it's because I logged off. That's not true. <laughs> you went from 24 <laughs> to 23 because I logged off. No. Well, guys, he didn't know I was going to spring this on him, and uh, I've been thinking about this for a little bit. I wanted to take that uh, real mower off of his hands for a few moments and uh, see what we can come up with, see if we can get into some mischief with that real mower. That guy has some bad influences. I do. I've, I've been around too many low guys lately. <laughs> He's finally coming to his senses. Maybe. 
Maybe you don't really know what I'm going to be doing with it. And oh, I, well, me. I mean, I would hope that you're mowing with a real mower. Well, I'm not going to break it. Well, <laughs> well, so Connor said also. So I guess uh, that's not a, a promising promise, is it? Oh man. Well, I think we're going to look at the. Uh, oh, he's going to. I'm. I was so. I'm torn. Um. I was thinking that I was going to let him use the John Deere, but ever since I fixed the John Deere for like the 15th time, uh, I've really been liking the John Deere. So I may make him take the Toro if he wants to take one. I'm not going to take clothes off for you. Coven. <laughs> not taking it off. Coven. Is Coven on there? Yeah. Coven. Where are you at, man? Right there. And I have uh, I have Kentucky bluegrass. I have a four-way blend of Kentucky blue. Jeremy is always wearing PPE. <laughs> <laughs> These are cheater PPEs. It's so I don't have to look at the camera. I can look wherever I want. And it looks like I'm actually paying attention. But my ADD is everywhere else. Right. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do the sunglasses we, thing. It drives me crazy. I have to have them on because if not, I'm everywhere else and people think I'm not paying attention. I'm not I paying am. attention. I look everywhere. I don't care. <laughs> it's all good. Jeremy's, Jeremy is always a professional. Yeah, we'll call it that. Always professional. I, uh, he would never mow his grass with no shoes. No. No, you got to put them hobbits somewhere else. Hobbits. Where's Connor? He's probably he's probably <laughs> doing his like fifteenth pass on the uh, triplex. Yeah, yeah, and that will only take him twenty minutes. Um, what's the deal with monocultures? I don't I don't see any uh, I don't see any issue with doing straight midnight KBG. I don't think that would be a bad thing. The only problem you might run into with something like that is if you get any kind of disease or you just get something that just kind of starts wiping it out. You don't have anything else that will be blended in there to assist it. As long as you don't run into any kind of disease pests, anything that's hitting it, you should be okay. That's the only thing that you could run into. Is Science. Just, uh, yeah. It happens. Oh, it's down to 22. I know. <laughs> Maybe You're I should driving leave. the people away. Maybe I should leave. Maybe I just I just came for the mower. I didn't come for the talk on the camera. Um, any other questions, comments, concerns? Anything? I have concerns. It's, it's plain out. Before soon. before I shut this down, I haven't checked on my wife or baby for a while. Uh, <laughs> I have two crazy eyes, so yeah, it, it works out the same, I guess. When are we gonna do our annual forum group gathering? I think, uh, I think we were talking about fall time, like after, right after the season, I believe. Annual forum group gathering? Yeah, when so, we all got together and huh. hung out at that hipster place in Salt Lake. I thought when, uh, when Ryan came, we were going to get something together, but he was snuck around Utah, obviously. Right, yeah. So Me and, me and Jeremy weren't cool enough for Ryan to stop in. No, nope, not even in a Connor car. When are you, hey, Jake, there's more of us here. Why would we all go to Indiana? Doesn't it make sense to come here? That's what, I, what's all, that's what all the cool kids are doing. Come to Utah. There's like 75 of us here. <laughs> Every week, there's a new YouTube channel that pops up. Um, tornadoes. At least it wasn't tomatoes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at look at Paul. Hit that like button. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. All that fun jazz. But I would imagine that if you're not subscribed, you wouldn't be on here. Maybe. I don't. Maybe. I'm not, you're cool. Getting, you're I'm not getting, cool enough to be trending on YouTube. But you're getting big enough that uh, I should probably pander your crowd and ask for some of that. That's right. Yeah. Hey, subscribe to this guy. Freaking Jeremy of, of the Greener Lawn. The Greener Lawn. But I don't know. Can you search Jeremy of the Greener Lawn? No, it Will it pull your channel up? It doesn't work. <laughs> I've got to, I've got to start that. Who's going to GIE? Man, GIE is too far away, Jake. I don't know what I'm doing like tomorrow, so I surely don't know if I'm going to GIE. Utah is lawn care mecca. We take pride in it. 
we take pride in it. I mean, look at this. Look at what, what. We might have to look do how a, good that looks. a caravan, though, for GIE. Get a bunch of us in a, like a little minivan and just go ahead and road trip it. I think it'd be a blast. Could you imagine that? Trip? Oh, I don't want to drive all the way there. Chicken. Yeah. I have Jimmy in. Jimmy, Jimmy will do it. Jimmy's just, Jimmy's nice. He's just not going to say no. <laughs> I, it might nice. have been me that brought that up. He's too nice to say no. Yeah. You on there, Jimmy? Was it my fault? Jimmy's <laughs> probably asleep by now, man. It's like, eight, what time is it? It's like 8.30. Jimmy's in bed. Hmm. Early to bed, early to rise. That's Jimmy Lewis for you. Yeah. Sure. He's probably going to text me and be like, stop talking to him. <laughs> Uh, yeah uh who's going to denny's outside of gae yeah that would be the only place i would go sounds good it was a good place during uh oncology it was the happening place was the denny's that's where you have to go it was it was well all right let's, we're gonna wrap this yeah, up it's you're almost it right there at an, an hour, hour. <laughs> and i can't believe that there's actually people still watching i know i know <laughs> Good night, Coven, Coven, whatever your name is. I screw it up all the time. I usually get yelled at by him. Obviously, Jeremy's I like... didn't screw it up this time. All right, guys. Oh, no, no. We'll no. see you later. We probably is sharpening his blade. I'd be playing with that, too. I wouldn't have a blade left if I had that thing. <laughs> that thing would rock. I need to take my blades down to him. That's the way I should have gone instead of him getting this grill. Shut up. Anyways, I'm Jeremy of the Greener Lawn. Make her green. You